Hi everyone, welcome. This is my DVD burning tutorial. I'm going to show you the quickest and easiest way to back up your movies that you own. Two programs you're going to want to use is going to be any DVD and clone DVD. I'm going to show you where you can get these. We'll go ahead and open up our browser. And this is the web page. It's slysoft.com, S L Y S O F T.com. And on the front page, you're going to have any DVD right here. And you can just click the download button there. And also clone DVD. And you'll want to download, as, download that as well. Each one of these programs will give you a 21 day trial. And you can then uh, purchase those after the 21 day trial. They're definitely worth it. I would recommend them. So we'll go ahead and close this out once you've downloaded and installed the programs or the trials. Any DVD is the first one I'm going to show you. Once you have it installed, it's going to be located right in the bottom corner here. Mine looks a little bit different, but you'll see this little fox head down in the corner. And you'll want to go ahead and click him. And right now it's going to say that there is no disc in pre that is present. So we'll go ahead and stick our movie in. And here in just a second, any DVD is going to pop up and let you know that it's scanning the disc. There it goes right there. It takes just a second for it to work. Right here it's basically showing you what it has removed and oops, let's close window media's player. Okay. This shows you the encryption that's been removed from the program and what this program does is allows you to be able to uh, send it over to clone DVD mobile or the clone DVD2, I'm sorry. Uh, so you can actually burn this. So there's nothing you need to do with this. We'll go ahead and click OK. We're going to go ahead and open up our second program. I have mine loaded. I'll show you where it's located at, though. It's going to be under Elaborate Bytes, Clone DVD 2. And we'll click Clone DVD 2 again. You're going to have three options from the main Clone DVD 2 page. You've got Copy DVD Titles, Clone DVD, and Write Existing Data. Copy DVD Titles, that's if you already have the file onto your computer. You don't have to stick a disk in. Clone DVD is what we're going to be doing, burning straight from disk to disk. The right existing data, we're not going to mess with that right now, so we'll go ahead and do Clone DVD. Up here in this box, you see DVD fi video files. The button you're going to want to click is right here. And you're going to navigate to your movie, which it's in my E drive. Click the name of the movie, and just hit OK. This is going to load up all of the chapters. It's going to scan the disk. We really don't have to sit around here and watch this. We'll just hit the next button. This is your audio and subtitle settings. If you are running out of space on your uh, disk and you don't have enough room, you can uncheck some of these subtitles, like Spanish, that you're not going to listen to. Generally, though, you don't have to worry about that. You can just skip through this. Your next option, make sure this is highlighted DVD writer and you're just going to want to select your DVD drive. Now if you only have one, there will only be one listed. If you have multiples, you have your choice of which one you want to burn to. I'm going to select my fastest one, which will be the F drive. And I'll just want to click the Go now. And this just basically tells you what it's doing. Uh, once this reaches 100%, Clone DVD will pop open and let you know that it's uh, ready for the next disc. You go ahead and stick your blank disc in the drive that you selected. And that's it. It'll be done burning. So that's pretty much it. That concludes the uh, DVD uh, tutorial. Thanks for watching.